All right, guys, good morning or good afternoon. It is around 12.30 right now-ish, and uh, we're gonna get to starting this video. with today is, um, what's today? Sunday? And it's Sunday fun day, so um, yeah. Anyway, um, today we have a different install for you guys. It's not for the hatch today. We have another install for the hatch the next video around, or the next time around. So um, yes, um, right now quad is sitting here in the garage. Can you guys tell me what is missing on this quad? It's just a front and end only. Can you guys guess? Front end only, guys. What is it missing? So if you guys don't know, quad hasn't had a light in a long ass time. And speaking of lights, give me a second here. So check this out. We were in Fresno yesterday. I went out, whatever, um, just chilled. Took my girl out to eat. It was our anniversary, whatever. And uh, took her out to eat. We're gonna go get some, uh, I think. Well, we're gonna go, go, I don't know where we were headed at this time, but it was late in the night. It was like nine o'clock-ish. And uh, check out what happened to my hatch, guys. This is all bad news because uh, it was something real JDM. It was something Stanley that gives you guys a clue what that could be. So um, check this out. This is so sad. Like, oh my. Yeah, let me just show you guys. No. <laughs> I'm missing a corner light, guys. This, this sucks, bro. Those corner lights are so expensive. So this really, really sucks. I'm gonna have to go with like some eBay ones for a little while until I can get some more money to buy another pair. But um, damn, that's annoying. Anyway, let's get back to this light install. So um, Quad is getting a light today. So we have two different boxes here. And first one I'm gonna open is uh, a mount. So um, let's open this up. So we have a mount right here. It's by Rigid Industries. Uh, I'll put a link down in the description below so um, you guys can check that out if you guys want to grab one of these. Okay, so first, this is the same um, wiring harness that I got from uh, for my truck actually, for the light bar. Okay, last but not least, the best piece of the puzzle there. We got some more hardware here. Check this out. Ah, yeah. You see that that's three row right there, four row actually, because it has the LED bars in the or the LEDs strips in the bottom, and then it has three rows right here, and then another one at the very top. Really, really cool. I can't wait to get this thing installed, guys. Um, I haven't had a light on my quad for I don't know how long now, and it's insane. Like I need one really, really bad. Hopefully, this helps out a lot. We're gonna mount this on right now. Okay, guys. So first step to this is going to be drilling a hole. So we got our drill here with our drill bit. We're gonna drill into here. This is gonna go on here just like this, just like so. You're gonna drill around here and around here. Success. But we need a bigger hole, so I, this is the first drill. Now we're gonna get to doing the second one real quick, and we should be fine after that. I gotta do this hole now, guys. It's gonna take like a whole another five minutes. So let's, I'm gonna turn this camera off. Okay, so both holes are drilled there. Make sure not to get into the um, uh, VIN number there. This is the screw, hopefully it fits. Ah, it's perfect, it's perfect fitting. Okay, so that doesn't get a washer. Washer goes under. And it also goes along with one of these crush washers here. I don't know if it's wa washer than crush washer. I'm not sure. If you guys know, let me know. I'd love to know. And you guys probably can't see that, but I'm going to do washer then crush washer. And then nut. So we have it mounted just like that. Bol bolts go through here. Or the, yeah, the bolts go through here. And then from the bottom, we have a washer, then nut, I mean crush washer, then nut. I'm gonna get to uh, tightening this up, then we'll get to throwing on the um, the light bar, and we should be done, guys. So, um, yeah, really quick install. So that's how it looks right now. From the front, that's how it looks. Here, just like so. Oh, bitch. 
Okay, guys. So that's what it's gonna look like right there. She's all tightened up. Now I gotta do the wiring, guys. All right, guys. Let me show you guys where we're at so far. So, um, relay is mounted right there. I don't know if you guys can see that very well. Relay is right there. It's mounted onto this uh, gray piece here. You guys can see it there now. And then uh, we have the battery cables connected, the red and the black there. Now, we already ran it through here. Now we're gonna run this along the uh, the uh, chassis here, the, uh, the tubing there. Now we're gonna run it behind here, all around here, and see what's good so we can yeah, we're gonna move, move it all the way through here. I don't know if you guys can see my fingers. Right through this little hole right here. Hit that switch, Aiden. So there it is, guys. You guys can see how bright that is. Already, that's cool. Now, just imagine that in the night. I'm gonna. Can you turn it off? That's yeah. Cool uh huh. And then this light will turn off when you hit the switch. Hit the switch, Aiden. Let's see that. All right, so let me close this garage real fast. I'm gonna close this garage. And then Aiden's gonna hit that light switch for us. Go we'll turn off that other light real fast. I'm gonna get on this quad real fast. Let me show you guys. All right. Turn it on real fast. Okay, you wanna leave it, leave it? Close that door. All right, so this is completely black, all right? Check it out. Sauce. Can you guys even see me? You guys could even see me in here. So that's just one light bar, guys. That's just one light bar. We're gonna add more in the future, and uh, that's just to go night riding for a little while. That should do the do the trick. It's bright, huh? Yeah. Switches on, switches off, switches on, switches off. Sass. That's perfect. So uh, we're gonna open this garage back up, and we're gonna be finished with the install. We're just gonna um, okay. zip tie everything up, and we should be done, guys. Open it. Yeah, we're gonna zip tie everything up, all the wiring up, and we should be done with this install, guys. So yeah. All right, guys, so wiring is all done. We got models in here chilling, and uh, we're starting to do this. We already drilled into the fenders, <laughs> and I didn't show you guys into the hood and the fender, and we're going to zip tie this up because this always pops off on me. There we go. <laughs> Phil. Oh, she was gross. And I just ran it right here with the zip tie, ran it around the thing, the uh, the handlebar. This is like this. Hit that switch. Light is on. I adjusted it as well. Now it's like pretty much set. Well, I think I need to bring it more this way to the driver's side a little bit, but for the most part, it's centered. So that's gonna wrap it up, guys. That's that's it right now. Light is is legit. It looks really really good. I think the placement is perfect. It like gives it like a, a new look and I like it. I'm digging it. And uh, yeah, guys, that's going to wrap it up. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.